the Democratic Party or the Republican Party. What kind of choice is that? Neither of them will ever put the freedom of the people on the ballot. Never. In fact, the fear that the real deal would get on the ballot would have you attacked at five o'clock in the morning and accused of being a Russian agent. Yes, right. yes, yes, yes. We ran. Come at Jesse Neville there. White guy. Uh, who is the head of the Uhuru Solidarity Movement? 2017. In a city, not like St. Louis, majority African city, as much as they're doing right now. To change that, right. Right. to change the demographics, to push the Africans out of here. But St. Petersburg, Florida, a 20% African population. And Jesse courageously stood up and ran for mayor in that city mm. off the slogan, Amen. Unity. You want to unite this city? Unity through reparations. And he ran next to Comrade, com, comrade Achille Anai, who's who was also attacked in St. Petersburg, Florida. They said that we are supposed to be able to run for office. Right. It's not like we attacked City Hall of right. an AK-47. Right, right. It's not like we woke the mayor up at 5 o'clock in the morning with flashbang grenades Come or on. anything like that. Right. We're just running for office. Right. You right. say that's what you're supposed to do. Yes. If you want to advance your cause, run for office. Right. Yes. But they don't want you to run for office. They want you to run for office on their terms. Yes. If we had said, uh, 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 let's fight against racism, uh, which is an extraordinary struggle, how do you know when you won? Yes. Right. Right. I'm fighting against racism. Yes. How do you know when you won? Did you win? Did somebody come out waving a white flag saying, we surrender? Yes. <laughs> I like it now. <laughs> it's fallacious, isn't it? Right. But colonialism is real. Yes. And